So by now you started a new section in your notebook. I'm going to go ahead and catch up with you. And what was the name of that section again? Intro to Isometric Sketching. And I'm going to go ahead and make that a capital I. Isometric Sketching. And what's the date today? 9-3. Let's go ahead and start by defining the term isometric sketching. Isometric sketching. And let me darken this just a little bit so y'all can see it. And I know my handwriting isn't the best. If you need me to uh, say a word because you can't read it, just raise your hand and let me know. And I will be happy to. Reread it out loud for you. So, isometric sketching is a form of pictorial sketching. A form of pictorial sketching. In which all three drawing axes or I guess it's axes, axes because axes isn't a word. All three of the axes, so that's the X, Y, and Z axis, right? That's what it's talking about. Form angles of 120 degrees. Of the plane of projection. Of the plane, sorry, not of, with the plane of projection. And you should be sketching in pencil. That way you can, you know, erase any mistakes as opposed to me having to scratch it out. I only do it in pen over the projector because it shows up better than pencil, I find. With the plane of projection. Cool. Now. By now, you should have taped this in floppy in your section. I'm going to flop it over, and then I'm going to add a couple of notes for myself. When you see a measurement of 0 0.25 on isometric drawings, when you see that, let me zoom in just a little bit more. When you see that measurement, that is equal to 1 square. So what would 0 0.50 be? How many squares would that be? Shout it out. Two squares. Thank you. Two squares. And then, of course, what would 1.00 or a measurement of one equal? Four squares. All right. For this next part, we're going to go ahead and grab our isometric paper. Now... It's really important, if you look, I'm going to zoom out just a little bit, you want the lines that are vertical, like this. You do not want it horizontal like this, where there's no vertical lines. You want it vertical, and we'll start sketching on this in just a moment. 